Hi, my name is Scott Allen and you're watching The Smile Minute, where we bring you positive news stories from around the world. Rodney Osborne knows how to make the most of his coupons. Osborne recently donated nearly $1,000 worth of products to charity, but it only cost him 37 bucks. Osborne's bread and butter are the Sunday newspapers, which are loaded with coupons. His frugal ways began when both him and his wife lost their jobs a few years back. Now that they are financially recovering, Osborne is determined to use the money-saving skills he acquired to help charity. In his recent store savings, he purchased 50 boxes of Kellogg cereal for nine cents a box and 176 school-related items for only $5. Leo Garente runs a junk removal service called the Junk Depot in Massachusetts. In his working days, he's run into a lot of interesting items, such as World War II helmets and Confederate money, but his latest finding put the others to shame. While cleaning out the home of Valerie Veloso's late mother in Medford, Garente stumbled across an envelope that contained 21 Class E U.S. savings bonds from 1972, worth $1,000 at the time. Now, the bonds are worth about $114,000 total. Garenti told CBS Boston, it warms my heart just to know that I helped someone. Susie, the six-year-old poodle, may have gotten her traveling fill for the year. After being hit by a car, Susie got stuck inside a car grill for an 11-mile cross-state drive from Massachusetts to Rhode Island. The driver of the car didn't notice anything strange about how the car was handling, but a nearby driver thankfully spotted the dog and flagged down the car. Animal control was called to remove Susie from the vent just below the front license plate. Susie was then sent to a vet where she was found to have suffered a concussion, a minor bladder rupture, and a lost tooth. On the bright side, she fully recovered and was later reunited with her owners after they saw the local Massachusetts news. You're a tough dog, Susie. I'm Scott Allen. Thanks for watching and keep on smiling.